One of the interesting aspects of combining BPM and SOA as proposed by the Aris Bridge integration is the fact that you can now use an end-to-end -end approach to go from process design over process execution right into process performance management. To enable this closed-loop P2A integration, we use the E2E bridge in combination with Aris PPM, where the E2E bridge acts as a generic adapter to extract KPIs from existing backends. These can be standard applications such as Oracle, SAP, and many others. The E2E bridge can also be used to provide KPI access to custom-built applications, as we will see in the next customer case. Here we look at the project performed by Swisscom, the Swiss leader in telecommunications. Amongst many other offerings, the Swisscom FixNet division offers network solutions for small and medium enterprises. Swisscom started from a situation where they had very little transparency over the existing business operations. They decided to implement Aris PPM in combination with the E2E bridge to improve process performance using the E2E bridge as a generic adapter to their in-house application called Ida Seco. Once implemented, they improved their process performance by factors in less than three months, and they had gained the transparency they were looking for, allowing for much more proactive process improvements going forward. The project was also a major improvement for the alignment of business and IT. The reason for this are the substantial productivity gains from using the purely model-based approach. For simple changes related to PPM, Swisscom needs now only 30 minutes whereas before it took three weeks and more to get a simple request in production. Even for more substantial changes, such as a backend application upgrade, Swisscom can adapt the PPM in just a couple of hours without any interruptions to the PPM system. You can also find more information about this case on the E2E homepage. In summary, the Aris Bridge integration can help in several ways to align business and IT and create a situation where business performance can be proactively managed. You can start with PPM to gain control over your existing processes. Then you can use the Aris Bridge combination to transform your existing application infrastructure towards a service-oriented architecture. And finally, you can use the interplay of SOA enablement and PPM to promote agility at the enterprise level. As you can see from the examples at Intrum and Swisscom, it doesn't really matter where you start this journey. We learned also that the maturity of the organization with respect to process awareness prior to the Aris Bridge project had no impact on the success of the outcome, which is encouraging given that most organizations feel they have a lot of work to do to align business with IT. In all cases we've seen so far, an open mind to use a new approach was the most important ingredient to achieve rapid success. An early win is always an excellent guidepost to continue the journey. When we look at the tangible benefits of the Aris Bridge integration, we can take three different views. From the business perspective, the biggest impact comes from the level of certainty gained by the end-to-end -end approach, which ensures that IT can really help improve the business performance on a daily basis. The gained flexibility leads directly to business agility. From a financial perspective, using the Aris Bridge has both a substantial effect on cutting costs and increasing profit. The acceleration that the E2E bridge brings to PPM deployments does not only reduce project cost, it provides a fast track to measurable process improvements independently of the maturity of the organization. From a technical perspective, well, it's been a dream for IT specialists to be able to execute the design not having to do any coding and having the documentation and the production system be in sync at all times. With direct model execution, that dream is now a reality. And independently from project size, organization, or industry focus, all projects so far have improved IT productivity by factors. It's important to note that direct model execution and model-driven integration does not mean that you have to change your IT strategy. It provides an accelerator to your existing strategy. At E2E and Ideas Share, we take interoperability with leading platforms very seriously so you can reuse what you already have. Since quite a while, the E2E bridge is, for example, certified for SAP. And recently, we have completed an effort together with Oracle to make the E2E bridge interoperable with Oracle Fusion. So, what's the next step for you? First, you can get more information on the subject either by looking at the material which is publicly available or you can directly contact E2E or Ideas Share. I mentioned the case studies about the two projects that we talked about. Both can be downloaded from our homepage. Secondly, you can have a closer look at the products which are involved, such as Aris PPM and the Aris Business Architect and of course the E2E Bridge.
The best way, however, to find out if this approach can work for you is to do a proof of concept on site in your environment, which both E2E and IdeaShare are very happy to do with you. All you need to get started is an open mind for a new approach. I hope this presentation has answered some questions you may have had at the beginning, but I'm also sure it has spawned some new ones along the way. Please feel free to address those directly to my attention using the email chenn at e2ebridge.com. Thank you very much for listening and goodbye.